All right, hey Cancer. So I am gonna do a quick singles read for you guys. I haven't done singles read in a while. I was waiting um, on a deck to come in, but I figure I haven't done it in a while. So I'm gonna do a read. For the singles all right if you don't resonate with um the energy i pull on you and your current feelings towards love you're going to want to check your other placements you guys um, everything else is going to be about the person coming into you um, all right and i am pulling initials on these reads but just because your initials don't come out doesn't mean that it's not for you it could be the person coming towards you and if you've recently met somebody and everything is lining up, um, this is going to be a confirmation read. And if you're new, welcome. I hope you guys subscribe. So I'm going to pull your energy and the person coming towards you. Wow. All right. So here's what we got. You coming out first. Um, the Ace of Cups. All right. So this is telling me that your energy, you're in, you're in love mode. All right. Um, I feel with the Ace of Cups, there's nothing that's holding you back, um, from the past. You are in the energy of, you don't want nobody from the past. Um, I feel like this Ace of Cups is a representation of new love. The person coming towards you is in the sun energy. So it could be a Leo that's coming towards you. All right, but this person, oh, they embody happiness. Um, this is happy. So um, their overall energy is they're good. Like this is the happiest card um, a person can get in the deck. So Cancer, what I'm seeing here is like it's it's going to be a beautiful connection. I'm just, uh, I don't even know. What, I'm, I have no words. You're coming out under Ace of Cups energy. This person's coming out in the sun energy. So, I mean, just a connection that I feel is going to be pretty solid. All right. That's good energy to be in when you guys are, um, when you're in the, um, I don't want to say when you're waiting for love because I don't feel like either you or the person coming towards you is actually waiting for love. I feel like this is going to be one of these bump and run and run into each other type of situations. Um, it is a 30 day intention read. Um, you know, time is fluid. It might go a little, a little past the 30 days, but, um, I do set a 30 day intention. So your overall, um, let's just see what you feel towards love, your current feelings towards love. Wow. So I feel like you've had a complete transformation. Um, with the death card coming out, I feel like you healed um, past wounds, past relationships. You're you're over. Like there's nothing. I don't feel like there's anything holding you back from um, actually calling love in. I do feel with the two of cups, you're looking for your um, the person that's supposed to be here. All right, for for the, till the end of time, you you don't want no more. I feel like you're in the seven of wands energy. You want the one person. All right. And you're not messing around you're not effing around with no, um, you're not playing games. You're not playing games no more. And you're not going to allow people to play games with you. I feel like that's the energy you are in. That's how you feel about love. You want the one person and you're not going to settle for anything less than the one that's supposed to be here. So if you don't resonate with that, you guys, eh, you should resonate with that cancer. So let's see who's coming towards you. Who is coming towards cancer? It could be a Leo. Um, wow, this is somebody brand new. Brand, brand new. This is somebody, I'm like so excited for you guys. All right, the full card represents new beginnings. Um, I feel like this person could be younger than you. It does not have to be. This is innocence. So this is going to be a fresh start and I feel like it is brand new. And with temperance coming out, I feel the universe is saying or confirming that this is going to be a soulmate. All right, temperance is, it is soulmate energy. It's um, balance. It's peace, love, harmony, um, commitment. All right, and then look at Ten of Cups energy. Um, so this person wants the ultimate fulfillment when it comes to emotional um emotional stability emotional fulfillment they want everything they want 
this happy life. Look at they're coming out in the sun energy and they're willing to give it. They want they want it. And I feel like this person knows what they're worth. They they know what they can give you. All right. Um, this is beautiful. Let's see what this person's like. Ooh, that's uh justice coming out. It could be Libra. Doesn't have to be. Wow. You guys, look at this is marriage right here. <laughs> I, I don't even have any words, Cancer. I don't have any words. You got the King and the Queen of Wands coming out. So you guys are going to be a power couple. All right. Um, what this person's like, they are looking for their match. And the same as you. All right. So I feel like you both have um, a lot of eyes on you. You guys could be in the public eye somehow. Um, I feel this is a, this is popular energy. This is fun. This is, um, a couple that can have fun together, laugh together. All right. And I feel like the, um, the, the sexual chemistry, the energy is going to be like just through the roof. All right. And I know that it's not all about sex, but I feel for whoever I'm talking to, you probably have a pretty high sex drive. And I feel like this person is going to be your energetic match when it comes to the bedroom. Okay. With justice coming out um, on what this person's like, I feel like this is the universe saying, um, cancer, you've done, um, you've done your alignment. You've done what you needed to do to call this person in. And this is karma. And I feel like this is karma. Um, this is a good balance. This is what the universe is rewarding you with um, because of your healing. I feel like it's because of your healing. So, dang, I really don't feel like I have to pull on what their intentions are, but their intentions. What is this person's intentions? They have been waiting for a long time for this, this um, type of love to come in. All right, the three of wands. That's somebody who's done their work. Look at, they're waiting for their ships to come in. Their intentions are they just want somebody as just as healed as they are. And I feel like that's you. All right, this person, this, I feel like they've been single for a long time. Okay, and it's like because they're not going to settle. Look at, they're in the same exact energy as you. They're not going to settle. They've done the healing and they don't want to mess around no more. They're done. So their intentions are all about moving forward and creating a life that is um, based on wishes and hopes and dreams being fulfilled. They want to move forward with, with success. They're, they're, this is not no flaky McFlakerson, you guys. So is this going to lead to um, commitment for cancer? I mean, do I have to even ask? Yeah. Does this lead to solid commitment? Look at that. That's the victory right there. Look at this is um, the universe confirming. All right. Cancer, you are going to be sent somebody where um, the high priestess comes out. OK, maybe you have gone through your um, period of emotions where you're like this. The love that I'm, I'm actually um, looking for is unattainable. All right. But it's not OK with the high priestess card coming out um, on. Will this lead to a commitment? Look at you have the ace of swords, which is your confirmation cancer. This is your energy all day long. And with the high priestess card coming out, I feel that this is a representation of the energy that's coming towards you. So somebody who's balanced in their divine feminine energy. And it doesn't matter if I'm talking to a male or a female. Um, just look up the spiritual meaning of um, being balanced in divine feminine energy, because we have both uh, feminine and masculine energies that we embody right we do um so if i'm speaking to a female the male he's going to be balanced in his divine feminine he's going to show emotions love um compassion you know the the energy that we have to learn how to come into and if i'm talking to a male this uh, female is going to be healed in where maybe um, in the past she's dealt with um rotten um 3D, egotistical, narcissistic dudes, right? Um, she's going to be healed from past relationships. She's going to know why those past relationships happen. And this is independence. This is um, stable. All right. And this is the this divine feminine. So cancer, I feel like um, here you go, man. This is beautiful, you guys. What is your advice? Wow. Again, just another confirmation from the universe. 
that this is going to be yeah this is brand new it's brand new you guys um are going to immediately recognize each other's soul though okay um i do feel with the king and queen coming out of the same suit and you guys have been here long enough to know that those on the same drop in the same question those don't happen very often so for whoever i'm talking to cancer this is really beautiful all right i feel with the hanged man and you know the spiritual enlightenment the universe is saying cancer you've done your job all right you get this and when it comes to you just accept it because you deserve it all right um it is a 30-day intention i'm not gonna pull cards to see when or how you're gonna meet but soon i will have a deck that's gonna express some of that um so i'm gonna pull some initials and it's gonna be yours or their first middle or last if yours don't come out just think of it as the person coming towards you. How many do we got? Let me get one more. All right, Cancer. I'm so excited for you guys. This is beautiful, man. We have M O V X U and N. So any of these initials can be applied to yours or theirs, or just um, if it's not your initials, it's going to be based on this person or something around this person that um, can connect you to this person. All right. So city, state, um, street, just any kind of abbreviation. So just pay attention to all the synchronicities. Okay. So it is a 30 day read. You guys stay high vibe. Um, I know that whoever I'm talking to, it's like, you know, that this is coming towards you and this is just going to be your confirmation that you've, you've been putting in that work and keep going in the energy that you're in right now, because this is beautiful. All right, cancer. I love you guys.